Welcome back to Dragon Quest Builders 2. We are currently aboard the enemy's ship. We are disguised as Hammerhoods right now. Oh, as Powie Yowies in the last episode, but I decided to change it up today. Our task is to find out the weakness of the hair force. So that is what we are gonna try and do. We're gonna try and eavesdrop on some of the monsters here and hope that they actually give us some intel. That would be fantastic. It's so cool that we can actually like just go around talking to all the monsters. It's pretty awesome. I like talking to the monsters. Eek eek! Have you ever met High Priest Hargon? Me neither, but I'd love to see him in person one day. I wonder where he is. Hmm, well, he's probably Maoroff in disguise. <laughs> <laughs> I'm guessing. Get out of here or you'll feel the full force of the hair force's hair and force. Hair and force. <laughs> How frightening. But why is he intimidating us when we are also monsters? Shouldn't we be allies? I don't know. Maybe they're just that savage. Okay, this guy says the same thing. All right, then can I talk to this werewolf guy up here to tell you the truth? None of us know how to work these ballistas, but don't tell the humans that. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> Are they just for decoration then, do you think? Okay, it looks like the rabbit's gonna tell us something. Okay, he just says the same thing. Oh, oops. Um, Are they not gonna attack me? I thought they would attack me. Hey you, keep your filthy hand off our ship, you filthy human. Th <laughs> oh, there we go. Dash it all, they've seen us. Ah, uh, I accidentally, I pressed the right bumper and I guess it took me out of my human form. Oh, it's the dash button. And I think that took me out of my human form. So that's annoying. We'll try this again. I'll have to make sure I don't press any buttons. <laughs> Apart from the X button, <laughs> of course. All right, we're slimes this time. Let's talk to the rabbit. Oh, I can't go in first person mode. That sucks. The captain will be hopping mad if he sees you lot away from your posts. Are you looking to end up inside a cell or something? Of course we are. We wouldn't be talking to you otherwise, would we? Now shut up and get out of the way, you dumb bunny. <laughs> Malroff, please let me handle this. Whisper, whisper, mutter, mutter, mutter. I wonder what he's saying. <laughs> I'm so curious. Um, why are you whispering? Good question. You want to hop into the cell and have a look around and make sure it's dreary and depressing enough. That's nothing to be embarrassed about. That's quite clever, actually. Hopefully we can get in there with that hostage. That would be cool. Go on in, but no funny business or you'll be stuck in there for good. Okay, I won't do no funny business. Oh, I can't wait for my shift to end. Being on guard duty is a pain in the scut. <laughs> Poor bunny. Okay, let's see what this um, girl says here. Oh, more monsters. Please, please don't eat me. Don't worry, I am a friend. I like her outfit. I wonder if I can get her outfit. Oh, great and powerful Hargon, hear my prayer. Save me from this wretched fate. But they're only, they're only slimes. <laughs> um, perhaps we should use the mod rod again to remove our disguises. That might speed up the conversation a little. Yeah, I think that that's, um, that's a good idea. Um, I want to return to your original appearance. Yep, I, um, I accidentally did that already. <laughs> So I know that all too well. Okay, here we go. Let's see see what they say. Goodness gracious me. Who in Hargon's name are you and how did you get in here? Did you not see our transformation? Ah, but where are my manners? Allow me to introduce myself. I am Hayden, a bard. I snuck onto this ship to look for food, but the monsters had other ideas. I bet they did. We're searching for a way to defeat them. You must have heard them talking while you've been in this cell. Did they mention any weakness they have? Anything we might be able to explore? Lloyd? Yes, please, I hope that they have. They're bound to have some sort of secret. Everyone does, but sadly, my jailer is a tight-lipped sort. He never rabbits on about anything. 
Hmm, well, there must be another way to get the information we need. If it's information you're after, the downtrodden and put upon are always the first to gossip, and a ship like this is bound to have dogs' bodies to spare. Maybe you can find one. Okay, let's start the hunt. All right then, multi, let's go. I mean, go. <laughs> Don't forget to use the mod rod before the monsters catch us. Okay, if I stay here, I'll only end up as monsters lunch. I'm coming with you whether you like it or not. Are you going to transform into a monster too? Okay, yes you are. Now there is more of these furry friends. Look at them, they're just so fluffy. <laughs> I just want to cuddle them. They're just so adorable. I love these things. I know they look derpy, but they're they're derpy and adorable at the same time. I like them. I like the power yowies. I love it. There's just so many of them. <laughs> Yeek eek! I haven't seen you around the ship before. You must be new here. Yes, I am new. So what if we are? Look, we just want to know what the hair force's weakness is. Are you going to tell us, or are we going to have to beat it out of you? As if he would like go around asking that. Like, I don't know, he's being a little bit too straight to the point here. <laughs> Malroff, please be quiet. Just leave this to me. Yeah, Jeremiah seems to know what he's doing. Whisper, mutter, whisper, whisper, mutter. I wonder what he's saying this time. Huh? One of the be werewolves has been making your life hell, and you want to know what their weakness is so you can get your own back? Yeek, 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 yeek. I like the cut of your jib, newbie. Unfortunately, I can't help you there. I might know someone who can, though. That poor Powie Yowie stuck on the after deck day after day would be more than happy to lend you a hand. Okay, that's cool. I guess this is what the monsters get up to down here. <laughs> it makes you wonder who they're actually against here. <laughs> Go up those stairs to the main deck, then go out through the rear cabin onto the after deck, and you're sure to find him. Eek, 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 eek. Okay, let's go and find this poor... Oh no, I did it again! Quick, change back before they spot us! Oh my god, I need to stop pressing the dash button. It's such a habit, I'm so used to pressing it. <laughs> I just keep doing it by accident. All right, let's do this. I like the way these little dudes jump. <laughs> They're kind of cute. I think that they aren't as good at jumping as a human, so maybe I should um, get this off. Yeah, I'm just gonna take this off a second so this is not working. Um, so, wait. Oh, didn't he say there was a back entrance? I'm gonna see if I can go through the back entrance because there's no way up from from that point so let's just quickly change back into something oh it's up these stairs i completely just like walk past it <laughs> oopsie but it's okay it's okay um let's see if we can talk to these little werewolf guys Grrr, someone's stolen my lunch i was looking forward to that sponge cake is that the one i've got in my inventory <laughs> i have no idea Get out of here or you'll feel the full force of the hair force. This job's going to be a cakewalk. Those pathetic humans in Moonbrook don't stand a chance against us. We can have all the fun we want. You wish. In your dreams, dude. We are going to wipe that smirk off your face. <laughs> Get out of here. Okay, a lot of them just seem to like saying that, don't they? All right, we've got a rabbit here. This ship's falling apart, but being members of the children of Hargon, we're not allowed to fix it because that would be building and building bad that's so stupid <laughs> but okay then all right I think this is the way we're meant to go they're all though what did he say I have no idea oh it's this guy yes is there something I can help you with there's a bull werewolf who's making life awful for you and you want to know his weakness though you can teach him a lesson <laughs> Yes, exactly. Listen, I may look big and nasty, but I'm not the type to nurse a grudge and seek revenge. Are you sure about that? Not like that scare wolf up on the forecastle. Perhaps you should ask him. He's the biggest, reddest, scariest chap on the whole ship. <laughs> 
I seriously love reading the the Yeti's dialogue. Like it's so amusing to try and talk with a lisp. It's just so weird to try and talk that way when you actually don't have a lisp. <laughs> But let's see if we can go and talk to this werewolf and see what he says. Hey little werewolf, how you doing? Aroo! You're new to the force, aren't you? How do you like life in the big leagues? I hope you're committing plenty of evil deeds. Yes, I am. So many. I've lost count of how many evil deeds I have done. <laughs> This job's going to be a cakewalk. All oh, right, he said that before. I already read that. That's enough out of you. Just shut up and tell us what the Hair Force's greatest weakness is. Morgoth's really impatient, isn't he? <laughs> You've got some spirit, newbie. I like you, so I'll let you in on a little secret, okay? All of us in the Hair Force are covered in thick, shaggy fur. It keeps us safe in the storm whether that's one of snow or of swords but there's one big drawback is it that they get too too hot or something <laughs> i don't know if all that shaggy fur comes anywhere near a flame we go up like a sack of kindling ah bury us in ice and we'll be right as rain but bring a candle too close and woof <laughs> My goodness, Malroof, you've learnt more in an afternoon than I discovered in my many long years living amongst these monsters. Maybe you just had to, you know, ask him straight to the point. <laughs> This information is very useful indeed. We have our inspiration. Our new magical weapon must harness the power of fire. Oh, okay. It seems our mission here is complete. Let us return to Moonbrook Castle before our true identities are discovered. That sounds like a plan. Have I learnt the recipe already? A Sizz Snare. Cool. A weapon of war that fends off forward marching foes with searing flames. It shoots up columns of fire. Very cool indeed. I can't wait to see it in action. All right, let's go. Time to escape. They will never know that we were here. <laughs> right, back to Moonbrook. And I'm assuming I've got to talk to the king, but I'm not 100% sure. So I probably need to build these to actually complete the rest of the blueprint. I think the rest of it's been finished though. Um, we have new people, don't we? Of course, we have this Jemiah dude. I kind of like this guy. He's he's interesting. My stars! Moonbrook Castle stands strong once more, but there used to be, sorry, used to be naught but ruins here. But we rebuilt it. Well, sort of. <laughs> Grandfather? Oh, Esther, my dear, my sweet Esther. I'm so happy to see you alive and well. Jemiah, you're back. After all these years, you have finally come home. I thought this day would never come. All is well. Everybody's happy. Yay. <laughs> the wisest man in the realm is returned to us. Moonbrook's revival proceeds apace, old friend, and with your wisdom, it shall surely grow speedier still. Awesome. I hope so. I hope that he can contribute something to our cause. Multi, neither I nor my dear granddaughter have ever subscribed to the children of Hargon's hateful teachings. Let us join you and work together as builders. Right, sounds like a good idea. Goodness gracious me, hating the children of Hargon, becoming a builder, this old fellow must be out of his mind. Oh Hargon, Hargon, hear my song. Is he actually... Oh, he's humming. <laughs> I'll still be true to you. If you trust in Hargon, you can't go wrong. Uh, do, de do, de do, do. <laughs> I feel like he just made that up on the spot, but okay. Oh, my ears. What is this awful cacophony? Are you a monster in human form sent here to drive us all mad? Quick, send him away. <laughs> Okay, so we got two new peoples in our town. Maybe the bard will like put on like some kind of show. Like when we have 
the celebration that we usually have, like the party after we kill the horrible evil monster that's, you know, terrorizing the place. Maybe he can like be our singer. That would be so cool. That would be awesome. Okay, I'm going to stop the episode here for now, but I'm looking forward to seeing where the story goes next. Now that we have found out the weakness of the children of Hargon, I wonder what our next task is going to be. Well, it's probably going to be to make the the little fire traps that we have but I'm looking forward to seeing them so I think that's going to be really cool. I just want to give a huge thank you to everybody who supports me on Patreon. I am uploading exclusive anime reviews only on Patreon and it's only one dollar a month to gain access. The link is in the description. Thank you for watching. I hope you enjoyed. Please comment, rate and subscribe and I hope I'll see you next time.